Hey, welcome back to That Roof. We're in Los Angeles, California, and we're doing a torch repair on top of a cap sheet roof, on top of a 72, on top of a 72 pound granulated cap sheet. We're doing a repair. Over here in this area, there's a big giant bow on the roof, so it's pulling water. So now we just want to install a couple layers of torch. It's a rubber modified roofing material. It has tar built into it. You heat it up with a blow torch and it melts like butter into the deck. Now that's exactly what we want. We're not using any nails, no nails on this project, nothing, just just the torch, the torch material. So we're just getting ready to go through this pipe flashing right here. So I want to want to show you how we're going to do it. I want to show you how we're going to do it, how we're going to heat it up and kick it out. So that's your next step. So remember, we're working with a blow torch. Don't ever try this at home. It's too dangerous. If you want to do a basic roof repair using mastic or caulking or something like that, go for it. But don't try to use a torch. You better have the proper insurance, uh, general liability insurance, the bond, workers' comp, and all that other good stuff that goes along with using the torch. It's a big responsibility. You can catch the building on fire and burn it to the ground. And you don't want to do that. It's not good for your pocketbook. All right, so get back to this. Get ready to do this. Here's how we do it. Let me show you how. First step when you're working with a torch, you gotta make sure you gotta have gloves. Nice thick leather gloves. Don't use a cloth glove. It's gonna burn and it's gonna hurt your fingers when you go to do it. Alright? So once again you wanna have a blowtorch. <laughs> Okay, so that worked out pretty nice. We already had the cut pre-made around the pipe flashing. So now we just want to continue doing the torch work. You want to heat it up. You don't want to heat it up too much because then you're going to burn through the roofing material, through the torch material. That's not good. So you want to heat it up just enough. That's why you need to hire a professional contractor. You're not going to figure this out on the first day. You're not. It's too difficult. Let a pro do it. They can come in, knock it out quickly. The only thing it's going to hurt is how much it's going to cost you to have it done. So always negotiate with your contractor and I'm sure that they're willing to give you some sort of wiggle room with how to get the price down a little bit. But the most important thing is do the job right, use the right amount of material and get it done correctly the first time so you don't have to come back again and do it again. You don't want to do that. Okay, so let's finish out this roll right here and let's get it torched in. Okay, so now that we got to this point right here, we're getting close to a pipe flashing. We want to pre-make our cut, which makes it a lot easier instead of heating it up and fighting the roll to try to make your cut. With hot tar, it's a lot easier to do that, do it that way, but with the torch, you don't want to do this because this is a one-shot deal with this material and you don't want to screw it up or mess it up. So we're going to take our utilities knife, a roofer's utility knife. We want to kind of roll that out to where the pipe is, make our cut around it, and let's get ready to do it right. Okay, so that worked out pretty nice. So let's finish burning out the rest of this roll. And we're one step closer to being done with this torch repair. Okay, so that came out pretty nice. So we're gonna heat up the rest of this roll. We're gonna heat up a little bit more. We'll get back to you in a bit when we get a little bit more done. So we'll see you in a bit. Hey, welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so we're almost done with this torch repair. We're in Hollywood, basically. Hollywood in Los Angeles. Well, actually Hollywood. Up in the Hollywood Hills area. And we're just getting ready finish the job so to get a better perspective of where we are
that's Griffith. To get a better perspective of where we are, that's uh, Griffith Park right there, Griffith Park Observatory up there. And the Hollywood sign is somewhere over here, but we can't see it because these little mountains are blocking it out. So this kind of shows we're right at the base of the Hollywood Hills. Pretty cool. Okay, everything's good. Okay, so getting ready to get this all finished up and let's do it. Now that we got that all kicked out, now we want to come back and heat the seam up one last time on the edge, make sure it's completely sealed. Okay, so that's how you do a torch down repair on a cap sheet roof. Hey, welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so we're all done with our rubber modified torch down repair over this flat roof in Hollywood, California. And as I showed you before, we're located pretty close to Griffith. We're located pretty close to Griffith Park Observatory. Tough word to say. And uh, it's a pretty cool area, love it over here. We're doing an apartment complex. We just finished this repair over the flat roof. I think it came out pretty awesome. So we did a double layer. We did one layer of smooth torch down and one layer of a granulated torch down on top. Now we didn't use any nails at all. We didn't want to penetrate the roof and make any more holes into the deck. That was unnecessary. But we did a pretty big area. The leak was probably somewhere 
just past the pipe flashings over here, just past those pipe flashings. There was two leaks, one in each bedroom. So we wanted to make sure we got a good area all the way around it. So generally the rule of thumb is, wherever the center of the leak is, you wanna go like seven to 10 feet this way, seven to 10 feet that way, seven to 10 feet that way, so on and so forth, so on and so forth all the way around the perimeter where you're seeing the leak inside the roof on the ceiling. And so that's how you make sure that you get that all done. So pretty excited, got this all done be moving on to our next job so once again we got this all taken care of over here torch down all done everything's torched in shouldn't leak homeowner is going to sleep tight the people that rent the apartment are going to sleep well knowing that their roof is patched over the ceilings where they're living so anyways hope you enjoyed this episode of cover that roof how to repair a flat roof how to use torch down rubber modified smooth and torch down granulated rubber modified roofing material so hope you enjoyed this episode once again if you like it hit like and subscribe look forward to seeing you guys once again we, we're all done with this repair signing off from hollywood california so if you like it hit like and hit subscribe and look for us on our upcoming episodes of cover that roof showing you how to videos on how to repair your roof be it a flat roof a pitch roof a tile roof whatever it is we can do it big and small no job is too small or big for us so signing off from hollywood california see you next time on cover that roof see you in a bit